Jessica, thank you for joining us. Welcome to our kitchen, and this is the Half Pint Soup. We've gotten lots of requests for dessert items, which we don't, we have not done a video of that yet. So today we are gonna be making Sally's Baking Addiction Chocolate Chip Cookie Recipe. It is so good, it's easy, and the best thing about it is it uses melted butter, so you do not have to use a mixer of any kind. You can just mix it with a whisk, and it's so easy. They are chewy delicious, sweet. It uses a combination of brown and regular granulated sugar. It's so good. You ready? Yeah. Okay, so we are starting with two and a quarter cups of flour. We're gonna mix in a teaspoon and a half of cornstarch. Dump that in. Dump it in. Is it stuck? Yes. We are going to do one teaspoon of baking soda. That in and a half teaspoon of salt. There you go. Easy, easy, so you don't spill. So that's all you do with the dry ingredients. You set that aside, and then we'll do the wet. It's so easy. It is so easy. Mix it together. So here is three quarters. Be easy with that. Three quarters of a cup of melted butter. Whoa. Three quarters of a cup of brown sugar. But dump it easy because it won't splash. Oh. There we go. And it's then, splashing. well, it's okay. Half a cup of granulated sugar, brown sugar, and white sugar. Okay, now you easy, easy whisk those together so there's no lumps. You gotta hold it with one hand. Hold the bowl with one hand. And whisk it easy so you don't spill butter. Whoa. Most recipes for cookies do not call, do not call for melted butter, and so you normally have to use a hand mixer. Is this the water bowl? But this one uses melted butter, and it makes it much easier, I think, and it tastes really good. Now we're gonna add one egg plus one mm -hmm. egg yolk in there. Use your whisk and stir that in. Okay, and the last ingredient is two teaspoons of vanilla vanilla extract. Pour that in. And use your whisk and stir. Okay. Yep, you're gonna pour this one, pour this one into that one, pour the wet one into the dry one. Very good. Wow, that's so easy. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Stir them in together. Okay, mm. pour that in there. That's one cup of semi-sweet chocolate chips. Okay, you can stir those in. When you like to eat some more. <laughs> I eat some. Okay, we're gonna add, yeah, you can have some. We're going to add a half a cup of dark chocolate chips. Pour that in. Okay. <laughs> Pour that in there. <laughs> Pour that in there. <laughs> Thank you. Now, because it's melted butter in the recipe, the chips might not stick. JJ. The chips might not stick to the dough very well at first, but once you chill them um, in the refrigerator, they will. Okay, so we put the dough on some um, saran wrap or press and seal or whatever, and we just wrap it up in there. And chill. Okay, if I put them in the fridge? Yes. Chilled those for about two hours, two, three hours. You roll them up, you roll it like a meatball. You're gonna roll it a little taller than you do wide. Set it down. Okay, bake these on 325 for about 12 to 13 minutes. Thank you. These make about a dozen really big cookies. They're gonna look, they're gonna look, um, really undercooked when they're done because they're going to continue to cook when you take them out and they're going to be delicious. Okay. 
Thank you.